one of you those that decided to either to go for sleep, go to sleep, or participate in the time research task for Battle Day. I actually did buy the Battle Day ticket. Pokemon Go trainers split over Steep Go Battle Day time research task. Or Steep. I thought it said sleep, but Steep. So, did you do the 100 battles? Because that's a lot of time. I only got to do, I think, 10 or 15 uh, PVPs, which I lost more than I won. I, I didn't have a good day <laughs> when it comes to Go Battle, but um, I was going to do it at the, after like taking a shower and stuff. But um, I didn't get to do it, uh, finish it off because once I hit the bed, I just went to sleep. Um, I, yeah, I was too tired, man. Long day yesterday. Um, I don't know why they picked today. They could have picked yesterday, which a lot of more people would have probably done it than today because a lot of people would have been and, uh, doing their Mother's Day stuff, hanging out around with their mom and family and everybody celebrating Mother's Day. And, uh, yeah, um, that's what I was doing the whole time, too. I only got to do, like I said, 10 or 15, 10 to 15 r battles. And I didn't even get one research task done. So, waste of money there for me. Uh, let me know what you think, guys, in the comment section about it. What you did. Did you choose or not choose? <clears throat> Pokemon Go trainers are split over the steep time commitment required for Go Battle Day Stardust Research Test, which is, it is um, either you spend your time on it or not. And they give you a lot of Stardust, dude. It's a good deal for... Um, for Go Battle Day. I can't wait for another one. Hopefully they do even more. Maybe incentivize more. Especially on a day that's not a holiday. Not a holiday for anybody. Uh, make sure that it's not on that day. They Like I said, they could pick Saturday. Um, no, why not Saturday, right? Pokemon Go has launched another Go Battle Day for trainers to take part in complete tasks and earn rewards. Fortunately, the Pokemon Go community was not thrilled that a Go Battle Day Stardust time research event ahead of its launch on May 14th, with some criticizing the attic for incentivizing players to buy Stardust. Yeah. Yeah, there was an article on that. I think that's the link to that article that I did like a few days ago. Um, but yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm only criticizing it for being on the day that not a lot of people have time since, uh, depending on if, if you're spending it with your family or your, your mom or anybody for yesterday, it just happened in la the thing is it happened to land on Mother's Day and they should probably knew when, when was Mother's Day and should have picked a, another time slot, maybe like next week or like I said, Saturday. Now that the event has begun, fans have criticized different aspects of the Stardust Time Research event thanks to the step requirement involvement. However, not all trainers shared this uh, sentiment. Uh, yeah, this article was during the time uh, when it was going on. Um, so by the time uh, you're, you're watching this, it's, it's over. It was 24 hours. It wasn't even 24 hours. It was 12 hour. Uh, thing, um, I was disappointed that it was only 20, uh, 12 hours when it supposedly said it was 12 hours, I mean 24, when it was only 12, because it started at 12, unless it said 12 a.m., I, I probably read it wrong, Pokemon Go fans are not happy with Stardust Research Time, Time Research, a post on the Pokemon Go subreddit sparked a debate within the fandom after one user made a post titled do they really expect me to battle a hundred times today for one dollar month um on mother's day yeah basically on mother's day a hundred battles for one dollar on mother's day uh, i don't i like the deal though <laughs> the one dollar deal that was pretty cool to have for one dollar get twenty five thousand stardust especially if you're and in need of stardust 
the uh, OP attached a screenshot of the start of its time research task, which require players to complete a total of 100 Go Battle League with battles in just one day. Many fans voice their frustration at this daunting challenge involved in a time paid event. I it's um it was part if I did it it was probably money well spent but if I didn't finish I didn't even get to do one task. Why the f fuck is it a time research and not just a normal research? I'll do a hundred battles over the course of a few weeks, but not a chance I'm doing that in a day. Said one trainer. However, many in the comments argue that many fans willingly paid for this event and they're not obligated to participate. They expect people who are PvPing anyway to buy this for a bonus. You don't have any obligation to buy it whatsoever, said user forever background 737. Some fans also, um, yeah, you don't have to buy it. You know, it's, uh, it's up to you. It's up to you if you want to buy it. It's up to you if you want to participate it. That is true. Um, if you did buy it and didn't, wasn't able to finish it, that's basically what this, play, uh, this person is saying, that it's your fault for not finishing it. You didn't have to buy it either. That's what they're always, that's, that's what some people always will argue. Like, you don't have to buy it. They're not forcing you or telling you to buy it. And that's basically what that person is arguing right there. Some fans were also annoyed that the this particularly intensive time reacher day fell on Mother's Day and claimed that Niantic scheduled this date on purpose. Niantic has a pattern of putting stuff like this on holidays to try to get you to spend more time on the game. Same goes for special raid day and such. Others in the comments countered that it wasn't Mother's Day globally to which some players argue that it's currently Mother's Day in many countries and around the world, like the U.S., Canada, Australia, South of Africa, and the Netherlands. So yeah, there, all those people weren't going to find a way to move out because cause you're hanging out with your family, especially your mother, to celebrate her day. For giving you life and giving you whatever you needed in that life while you learn how to go and poop in the restroom <laughs> go use the rest teach you how to restroom teach you how to uh ride not ride bikes but uh, maybe drive a car or maybe not drive a car or maybe some things that a mother does nurture and care and who would want who will not who would want to miss on a day to celebrate that one that thing that she does throughout the whole year or the whole time of your life. Nobody, right? Nobody wants to do that. Nobody's going to do that. And nobody's going to make time for a game to do that. And if they're doing this on purpose, because I guess some people, this one of these people said, one of these players, or this trainer right here said, hey, um, this is on purpose because Niantic has done this again and again they always do it on holidays they always put them on holidays knowing when these holidays start they already know uh, the months uh the the day of mother's day they already had the information and for some odd reason they wanted you to play more of the game than hang out with your own family and friends and mother to celebrate your own mother well, uh, I don't know how long it would take to finish 100 uh, battles, but I would assume maybe, I think that's why they probably said, uh, that's why they gave you a supposedly 12, uh, 24 hours. I, I might have looked at the time wrong. I don't know. I don't remember what what it said. It probably said 12 a.m. instead of 12 p.m. That's when I thought it was going to be 12 p.m. And, uh, yeah, so I thought it was going to be 12 p.m. But, um, yeah, uh, it's kind of weird that they're always doing this on um, important holidays, holidays that matter to people, uh, and n making people choose to, like, either play the game or not to play the game. 
when it comes to these uh, special events. Crazy, man. Let me know what you think in the comment section, guys. Smash that like button, smash the subscribe button, share the video, ring the bell for notification. And like I said, let me hear your thoughts on this in the comment section. Thank you for being here, and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Peace.